Johnny Tarquin and Sea Pigeon as they come for the first. In the Welsh champion hurdle, Pollardstown, the recent entry winner, jumps the first from Royal Boxer and Connaught Ranger, Sea Pigeon, the champion, and Johnny Tarquin. We're passing the winning post on the first circuit. It's Pollardstown from Royal Boxer and Connaught Ranger and Sea Pigeon and Johnny Tarquin. Going quite a good clip. This is the race that's brought really large crowds here, large holiday crowds to Chepstow this afternoon. And they're seeing Pollardstown press this rise ahead of the locally trained Royal Boxer, then Connaught Ranger, tracked by Sea Pigeon, then Johnny Tarquin. With handsome prizes for the first four. Pollardstown, Royal Boxer, Connaught Ranger, Sea Pigeon and Johnny Tarquin. Second of the eight flights. Pollardstown, very slow at that one, and very deliberate, and Royal Boxer jumped up ahead of him on his outside. Connaught Ranger's third. Sea Pigeon four and five, Johnny Tarquin. They come to the third flight. Royal Boxer on the outside of Pollardstown. And a mistake there by Sea Pigeon, a very uncharacteristic mistake, just uh, Pitched a little there. John Joe O'Neill not looking at all worried, not uh, trying to get any closer to them at the moment. Over the fourth. Royal Boxer on the outside of Pollardstown, then Connaught Ranger, then Sea Pigeon. Behind Sea Pigeon, Johnny Tarquin. Johnny Tarquin uh, finding this a little bit too hot, this pace for him. Really getting out of touch now. Now they've got a very long run before the fourth flight from home. Pollardstown on the inside of Royal Boxer. And a Connaught Ranger and Sea Pigeon. Sea Pigeon, the champion, getting a little bit closer to them now. Pollardstown, Royal Boxer, a little between the two. Connaught Ranger and then Sea Pigeon. And Sea Pigeon still closing perceptibly on the other three as Pollardstown leads from Royal Boxer, Connaught Ranger. The Daily Express Triumph Hurdle winner is now going second. Royal Boxer, third and four C Pigeon. This is the fifth. Half a mile from home. Pollardstown jumps it in the lead from Connaught Ranger. C Pigeon towards the left of the picture. Coming there strongly now, John Joe O'Neill to bid for his first ever a triumph at Chester. Over on the far side, Pollardstown jumps it in the lead from Connaught Ranger and Sea Pigeon. Coming down now to the second last flight in the Welsh Champion Hurdle, and it's Pollardstown being pressed now by Connaught Ranger and Sea Pigeon. Over the second last, Pollardstown, Connaught Ranger, Sea Pigeon. Coming down to the final flight now, Pollardstown on the far side, Connaught Ranger and Sea Pigeon, who's got it to do now as they come to the final flight. Pollardstown on the far side, Sea Pigeon coming there on the near side, in between the two Connaught Ranger, this is the final flight now, Sea Pigeon comes there very strongly to land fractionally in the lead, and it's Sea Pigeon now the champion, going away from Pollardstown on the far side, Connaught Ranger third, a beautifully confident written race this by John Joe O'Neill, he was the Ch Welsh champion hurdle, Sea Pigeon the winner from Pollardstown, second and third is Connaught Ranger, fourth was Royal Boxer, and just coming up to the final flight now, to jump it in fifth place, and make a little bit of a hash of it, but uh, get over it all right, is Johnny Tarquin, and so the result of